this picture? Yeah, dude. Okay. That was the funniest thing. All right, record. Start recording. I gotta. I gotta comment on that. I already recording. Oh, okay. Did you Did you do the whole thing? No. Okay, guys. So I'm I'm over here shooting the cover, the thumbnail picture, right? So I'm like, you know, I gotta. I gotta look like I'm strong, so I'm like pulling my shirt to make my muscles look big. I'm like, uh, yeah. Uh, uh, uh. And then uh, oh, uh, Alex, who just started working here recently, he's over there in the back, and all he says is, "There's a lot of moaning going on in here," and I'm just, well, bro, <laughs> that was funny. We all started laughing. So, you know, if you hear moaning, it's just David making sure he looks. Oh, buff. Oh. I, gotta, I gotta pull it back, and then you, you see, look, you gotta. You, this is the trick. Don't tell nobody. You go, you twist it, and then you pull. Hey, look at that. Look at those muscles. It's a lot of fat, but <laughs> hey, it works. Anyway, guys, this is David from Organic Prize Books with another review of a uh, title that we have for sale. Now, we've had this for a while, so it's not like a new release. Uh, it's just a first look. We're doing, uh, you know, some of the more uh, popular titles that we have, just so that you guys are aware that uh, we have it. And then, you know, you can be interested in the story if you'd like to. Uh, before we get started, as always, if you want to be eligible to win a $25 gift card, all you got to do is subscribe to the channel, leave a comment down below, and you never know, you might win, get that money, get yourself this comic, or this uh, Omni. Uh, okay, so it's gonna be Grant Morrison's Superman. I believe, if I'm not mistaken, this is the uh, New 52. Uh, but I might be wrong. If I am, let me know. We also do have our nice stands here for sale. You know, organic price branded right here. Very nice. We also have it colored. We don't have any available currently, but they, if you wanna put it on your wish list, whenever they are available, it'll pop up there for you. And we also have our whatnot sale over here. Let's uh, take a knee. Take a knee. Ah, that's right. Uh, so we got, you know, to win, we got to make sure that we bring in our A game, you know, we got to make sure we play from the heart, we play for the, the, our team and not on our number on the back, and uh, we got to make sure that, uh, you know, you play from the heart, you know, it doesn't matter, these muscles, they're good and all, but if you don't play from the heart, it doesn't matter, and that's what we do for the whatnot, we come from the heart, we bring you the stuff that nobody else has, these out of print, and we say, you know what, we're going to get you a good deal, we're going to get you Don of X, the whole lot, that's one lot, Punisher, the whole lot, that's one lot. Power Rangers, a whole lot, that's one lot. God of Thor, Thunder, one, one lot, we're gonna be number one. East of West, one lot, one lot. Captain America right here, one lot, we're gonna do it, one together. And Red Hood, this one's really nice, I like this one. One lot. So there you go, guys. That's how we win, that's how we win championships. Comes from the heart. Just like Superman, comes from the heart. All right, <laughs> so this is the, the front, the spine, and the back. I'm having a really good day, guys. You can probably tell that. Let's take a look. Let's take a look. Because he had all that moaning earlier. <laughs> <laughs> and, all right, so we have the I really like, like the this. cover of that one. Yeah. I kind of wish they would have just kept it going for the for the rest of it, but they didn't. So, yes, I am If I am correct. It's the new Superman where he has the the collared suit. If you see, he has, like, the collar on the actual so suit. So, like, James Bond Superman, bro. Yeah, and then like the belt is red, so this is uh, a redesign. Whenever they released the new 52, uh, uh, Jim Lee was the one who designed it. So let's go ahead and let me let me pop those that back. Oh, oh, let me just pop that cherry. I mean, what? Oh, creak, creak, creak. All right. So, okay, see this is Superman. That's the same one from the cover. Uh, so it is. Let's see, 2013, this is when it came out, 2012 to 2013, which was that uh, New 52 reboot after uh, Final Crisis, or after Flashpoint, I believe. Flashpoint, yeah. And this is the uh, reprint, new printing, without the uh, missing word bubbles. There you go. There were some that were missing word bubbles. That's actually pretty cool. Yeah. So yes, it, as you can tell, the, the art style is very modern. Um, and there's a lot of detail in the background. I like that. I always talk about that a lot. There's detail here, the bullets, this stuff. So I like that because it immerses you into the story. And this is the uh, Superman when he first came out. Basically, it's kind of telling his origin. Uh, not from when he was in Smallville, but when he started off as a superhero. So he's just wearing like jeans, boots, and a shirt. And a cape. Nobody knows who he was. That's why they're still like, like threatening him with guns because they don't know his powers. So it was a, a kind of like a soft reboot for him. And just this one is was the Superman run from Gant Morrison included just how he started, like a little bit of his powers. And it just goes over, goes over that with you because 
you know, as a new person or the new 52, they wanted to make sure that uh, they wanted that soft reboot to be inclusive for everybody who was just coming into the Superman universe. Uh, I, I like the new 52. It was good. I like the Justice League run of that. We have that available uh, because it includes all the characters and there you can choose which one you like. Uh, the Batman one is good as well, but it already has him established with like his kids. Damien and all that, so you know they couldn't they couldn't get rid of them. So it's not like new, new. Anyway, <clears throat> we're like, we're talking about Superman here. So our Boy Scout here, he gets caught. They're doing tests on him. Of course, nothing can break his skin. So they're just kind of figuring out his power, his cape as well. They're trying to see what why nothing is going through it. So it like I said, it's it's a soft reboot, and it kind of just goes over his powers and all that. And like they don't know what's going on they they're just trying to, to get a gauge the army's trying to get a gauge of superman and, and where he comes from so it does also go a little bit into his past where he comes from um but yeah this is a good story i like superman superman's you know the the original superhero he's the basis for uh i've said it before like all the every time a super every time a really strong superhero comes out all you hear in the on the inter internet forums like reddit can he beat superman nobody can beat superman 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 the the, old, the ultimate marvel versus uh dc fighters of course the hulk versus superman sentry versus superman um you know whenever like dragon ball z versus superman everybody they always compare it to superman Wait, because he's the basis but, but of saitama them. versus superman though. Tama versus Superman uh, Ooh, from wait. the boys. What is it? Uh, Homelander, Homelander versus Lander? Superman. Yeah, uh, are, uh, from Invincible. They always like. Oh, yeah. who would win? Uh, Omni Man. Omni Man versus Superman. So, so the, you know, he's kind of like the the base. Everything versus him, basically, which is cool because that's. I mean, again, he was the original one, and they kind of just. He is, in my, in my opinion, overpowered. Uh, but that's that's kind of you know you have to work with what you got and you have to give him flaws. And that's that's kind of what this story is about. Just his him being young, kind of getting set in his ways, or or figuring out what he's trying to do, the type of hero he's trying to be. So that's really cool. That this was like I said a soft reboot, and I really I really liked uh, the writing from Grant Morrison and the art style. This like I said was a reboot for all of of Marvel or not Marvel <laughs> DC Comics, and uh, I this was one of my one of the better ones because it included some characters we hadn't seen. Like this is Superman from a different universe where I believe he's like the president if I'm not mistaken and there's there he is he's getting shot um, but I didn't read the whole run so I know a little bit about it not a lot so let's take a look let's take a look this is David's first look at the book <laughs> oh look there's there's hamsters I like hamsters that's scary <laughs> If one of my daughters did that, I'd be like, you gotta go. Please leave. You know you can leave. Get out of here. So yeah, this is, I, I don't know how I felt about the costume. What do you? What did you think about the collared, like the col the collared costume like that? Like it goes high. Turtleneck. It looks like a little v-neck. Yeah. I think um, he looks more classy. Yeah? Yeah. Like a more gentleman. I do like I do like the fact that it's not an underwear that he's wearing, yeah. a red underwear. Yeah, <laughs> that was, that was kind of lame. Yeah, <laughs> that's kind of like my animated costume right now. <laughs> hey, hey, it's a classic. Um, I'm surprised you didn't do yours. Well, in, in the Omni Man cover or like the. In Wait, well, I wanted to, I'm probably gonna change it up a little bit. Hey, you know, it's just the first one. He's like, yeah, just make me whatever look cool. And you pick that costume. <laughs> if you know, we're talking about the little intro that he has right now. Uh, at the beginning of the video, which I think are really cool. I actually really like your intros. Who's this guy? Heroes with mustaches? No, sir. No, thank you. That's too, you know, you're too recognizable with that mustache. <laughs> Looking like, uh, like Burt Reynolds from Hawaii Five-O. I don't think he was in Hawaii Five-O. I don't know. Oh, look, he's fighting angels. Oh, what's going on? Oh look, there's more angels. Oh, they're attacking him? Looks like it. JP, I want this vest. Can I get this vest and wear it every day? <laughs> just just like that. Oh, you, man. <laughs> you do you. Oh, We don't man. have dress codes here. <laughs> oh no, somebody got shot. Oh no, and he couldn't stop her. Stop the bullets. 
Uh, yeah, so maybe he fights magic because magic is the one of the weaknesses for Superman because it's something that he can't really fight against, which I don't know why that is. I don't know, but if you know why that is, let me know. Kryptonite, of course, has always been his weakness. And... Oh, I like this style. This is nice. Very clean lines. Very clean. Crypto. Oh no, Crypto! No, not my dog! No! Oh, is that Doomsday? Whoa! That's interesting. That is very interesting. Is that Brainiac? Okay, so I think this is the end of this one. So let's take a look at the extras that comes with it. Okay, this is the, gal the variant gallery cover. Cool. This is Jim Lee's drawing of him. I like that a lot. You know, I like Jim Lee. He's, he's a very talented artist. One of my favorite ones. And then his renditions of all of the superheroes are really, really good. His Superman is really nice. I like the detail he puts into it. Uh, this one, the cover of this one is, is actually really cool too. I like that a lot. A more realistic one. Cool. This is him with his, or his parents. This is him as a little boy. With his dog, a boy and his dog. No pure friendship in the world. Okay, cool. I like that one. He's taking the arm off or something. Oh, that's, that's President Superman. There's a lot of extra. Hey, yeah, there is a lot. With, of course, the Batman. Oh no, he's getting beat up. Oh, he said, you stole my cape. I'm gonna steal your lunch money, pow. <laughs> there he is fighting against these angels. Then he's fighting against the devil. Let us know, what's your favorite Superman story? Because I don't really know too many. Yeah, uh, some of the ones that I know uh, for Superman, All-Star Superman is always a good read. Okay, so then you have a little bit of extra here. It has a little bit of the storyboard or like the black and white drawings and how it changed into it. Maybe they give us some more of the character development of it. Let's take a look. Oh, that's cool. Give you a little bit of the cities, how they drew it out. Okay, see? This is, what is the name? Superman of Earth 23. And you got your uh, steel. Steel, I always thought steel was cool. K-Man Green. K-Man. <laughs> Kryptonite Man. Yeah. With his mustache. What a weirdo. All right. It looks like... Oh, that's good. Logo. It just says logo. All right. There you go. That's the end of this one. So there you go, guys. This is the uh, brief overview of or first look at... Uh, Grant Morrison Superman. Uh, we have that available at uh, Organic Prize Books. And uh, tell us, like I said, what's your favorite Superman story? Do you like Superman? Do you think he's overrated? Hey, that's okay. You know, your opinion uh, might be wrong and other people will complain about it. But not me, because I accept you just as you are. And I'll see you guys in the next one.